What is emerging today, and particularly is recorded in the I, the independent newspaper, is that Suella Braverman's Rwanda project is effectively a private fiefdom. She had visited Rwanda a number of times between 2008 and 2010, co-founded a charity in Kigali, and trained lawyers working inside Rwanda's justice ministry. So n none of this, none of this was revealed in Parliament after she became the Home Secretary. And certainly nothing was revealed after she got elected to Parliament in 2015. All of this has been kept quiet by Suella Braverman, and she has championed Rwanda as her pet project and the place where she wants to send refugees that we don't want. She wants to outsource refugees to Rwanda, to people who she has trained and uh, nurtured. Extraordinary, an extraordinary story, um, which again points to a level of lobbying, a level of um, manipulation, a level of deceit and uh, nepotism that really we haven't seen, seen much since the days of the Borgia Popes. This is sordid, squalid and decadent, decadent in the best sense of that word. It is just wrong. And it's not even something that she was doing while she was in Parliament. It's something that she did before she was in Parliament and something that she doesn't seem to have thought was worth uh, telling us.